Hi, this is Sagittarius uh, star sign for the month of December 2017 astrology and I'm Peter the clairvoyant and I'm connecting through you with my clairvoyant so I'm not really working with the tarot or anything and I'm connecting with you on your level. Um, so what I'm kind of picking up here with you Sagittarians here is just feeling a little bit of frustration around you at the moment. It's almost like I feel like I'm trying to move forward and every step of the way I seem block, 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 block. It's like, it's just, ooh, it's like, can't get my head straight. And I just feel as though a lot of things seem to be going wrong around you at the moment. And I just feel so it's going to be short-lived actually. I feel so it's going to be more or less for the first sort of couple of weeks of December. And then I feel so once you get past that, I feel so you should find things calming down. So it's not going to be a negative Christmas, but it's like if you plan something, something changes, something goes wrong. If you're trying to buy a gift, it's like you go to the shop, it's not there. You've got to go to the next shop. They haven't, they've got it, but they've not got that colour. And then if you want to get your card on, oh, I'm busy today, can you come back tomorrow? It, 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 it's just stupid things. It's not like bad things, but it's annoying things. So it doesn't mean you won't get that present. It's just that you've got to find the next place. It doesn't mean you won't get the card on. It means you've perhaps got to come back the next day or go find another garage. It just means if you're relying on somebody to do something today, they can't do it today, but they can perhaps do it next week. It's just nothing goes according to plan. And it's almost like I feel like you, you're being pushed in a different direction. And you might not realise why that is at the time, but I feel so once you start to get what you want, there's a reason why you've had to wait. You're either getting a better deal, or you're getting something free, or you're getting an extra bonus, or, or a, a gift token. It's like there's some kind of reward at the end of it for your patience. So I just get the feeling, whether somebody's up there saying, Lou, you deserve a bit more sort of luck, but we'll give you the luck and whatever best way we can I feel like accept it because I feel so it's really good so like I say there's little blockages and it's frustrating but if you look at it and analyze it something good's come from it so I feel so don't sort of lose your temper you've got to keep your calm because then you will be rewarded for your patience and that's what it's all about okay some of you are going to be reflecting uh, back with loved ones who have passed on uh, sort of uh, recently. And when I say recently, you know, I don't always necessarily mean it's this year or next year. You know, when we've lost people, it feels like it's yesterday, doesn't it? And, and I just feel so you may want to connect with them. And, and I feel so that's absolutely fine. So we either sit there in your quietness and think about them flip through photos or go see a spiritual medium you know whatever you want and I'm not just saying that because I'm on here and that's what I do you know you can go see whoever you want you know and you can draw to their energy and that will be absolutely wonderful for you so you know enjoy that kind of connection because to get the feeling a couple of loved ones will want to come through and give you some positive well-wishing messages for this time of the year so that's really nice so I feel so enjoy that and I just feel so also I feel like within your mind and your body and your soul you seem to be getting stronger and and I don't mean sort of stronger of anything like strength but well I suppose it is a kind of strength but I mean to do with the way you're thinking the way you're acting about things you can start pushing your goals forward and I feel so this is really really good so go out there now and start making things happen because it's almost like you're coming up into a very positive period now where this is a great time now for you to be making things happen and I just feel so it's fantastic it's like it's really there <coughs> also I'm being drawn where and I know this could be very generalised because I'm connecting with a lot of you Sagittarians. But I get the feeling there's somebody in spirit. And I feel like his name's Arthur. But I'm probably connecting one particular person here who's going to sort of connect with you and resonate with you who's going to watch this video. And I'm being drawn to Arthur. And I feel so he passed away with throat cancer. And I just feel so he's a lovely, lovely man. But he did smoke like a trooper. And I just feel so he just wants to come through and he just wants to wish you a merry, merry Christmas. And, and he just wants you to look after yourself a little bit more. But he says he's fine, all his troubles have gone and he's there with you. 
so I don't know if anybody of you can take that Arthur who passed away with throat cancer um, so I'll let you think about that one see if it resonates first time I've done that actually on these type of readings but there you go you know when I get something I get something I just have to give it right okay um, so um, Christmas like I say, I feel so it's a pretty good Christmas for you. I feel so everything's fine, but like I say, you might feel so you can't get that present. You've got to go searching around or or I just feel so it's run out or we haven't got this colour. So you'll have to be maybe a bit flexible with your Christmas shopping. But other than that, I just feel so you should be fine. But don't get frustrated because I do feel in the long run you're better off. Or you may feel so, you know, you're not getting the right one and you just pick that one. But the person you're buying it for could absolutely bloody love it. Everything works out for a reason. So I just feel so it's quite intriguing. So they may be blocks to you, but they could be blocking you to make you do something else. Everything counts for a reason. So just see how all that sort of pans out for you. Um, some of you Sagittarians, I feel so if you're driving, watch out for your cars. Fortunately, I've got things going wrong a little bit. Do check your tyres. Do check you've got your water sorted and your oil topped up. And also, just watch your exhaust systems. It might be playing up a little bit. You probably will get away with it for a month or so. But as long as you can stand the rattling or the blowing a little bit. So keep an eye on your exhaust systems. Okay. Right, for those of you in relationships, I feel so those of you single, I just get the feeling now, don't sort of go and pushing, pushing, pushing to get it. I feel so just take your time and I feel so by the summer you should be quite settled. I'm not saying it's the summer you're waiting till, but by the summer you should be quite settled. And if those of you aren't, I just feel so just keep doing what you're doing, it will come in. And those of you who are in relationships, I just get the feeling you need to listen to your better off a little bit more than what you do. Because I feel so he's trying to tell you things, but you're not listening. Uh, it's almost like it's going in one ear and out the other, <laughs> so to speak. So keep an eye on that a little bit. But other than that, I feel so you should be fine. Family, family's okay, um, but I feel like you'll try to do a little bit more and connect more with family. And I feel so you're wanting to family and listen to you a little bit as well with your thoughts and feelings. And I feel that that's absolutely fine. So do and try and sort that out. Uh, some of you within your home, I just get the feeling you'll perhaps be thinking about doing some decorating, doing things up a little bit. And if it's just your room that you've got and you're living with your parents, I feel so you could be tidying that up and buying some new things in that's going to give you more space. I get the feeling of creating space. So it's like I feel so you can, you know, utilise your room a bit more. It almost feels like you, your room will become bigger because you can store better things or you can get more in. Because it's like I feel so you're growing and you're buying more things as you're moving through the next year. So make sure you've got the adaptable furniture as well. So don't just go buying without thinking where you're going to put it. Unless you can have a good clear out and that's going to create the room. Okay. But other than that, I just feel so home is generally fine. Not really picking up house moves at the moment. But next year you could be thinking about it. Uh, but other than that, you're okay. Uh, for those of you who are working, I just get the feeling, Korea, there's some great opportunities coming up now, but I don't feel that you should grab them or look for them until next year. But I do get the feeling this year you will be thinking about it. So December, you're going to be thinking about it, looking about what you've done and perhaps where you're going. And it's like you're going to be wanting to earn more money. But I get the feeling for most of you, you're not going to get it where you are. So I feel so you've got to prepare yourself to move on now and look for different jobs. And I feel that so that needs to definitely happen. So make sure you've got that sort of connection. But other than that, I just feel so you should be absolutely fine. Okay, you have to excuse me, my backlight just went out there then. So maybe it needs charging. Okay then, but other than that, I feel so you should be absolutely fine. So just keep doing what you're doing, embrace things. Don't let the blockages get you because they're happening for a reason. Okay, so if you need to connect with me, connect with me through uh, my Facebook page, Peter the Clairvoyant. Also my website, peterthecliavoyant.co.uk. And also I'm here for readings, uh, whether it be phone readings, personal readings or video readings, which is like this. And that's great. And my video readings are 1950. 
Okay, so I wish you a merry, happy Christmas and a happy new year. And I'll speak to you again soon. Thank you.